Hello, Sophia Chili here again, and today I am going to tackle this orange habanero. Am I in focus? Yes. Okay, so I have an orange habanero which I grew. Can you focus on that one? Touch the orange. Not as hot, sorry, not as heavy as chocolate oven there. Okay. Okay, I grew this. This is a plant that I started last year, which I managed to. Am I I'm all fluffy? I'm not fluffy anymore. Okay, I was saying, this. I don't know if you see, can you see this? Can you see it? Yes. Okay. This I grew from a plant. Obviously, it grew, grew from a plant. This came from a plant which I started last year, so it's almost a year old, about a year old the plant is. And last year the plant grew about, not many, it was about half a dozen of these um, fairly normal sized pots. And they were surprisingly quite hot. Now I'm told that the habanero is, looking at the internet, looking at other people, they, they're usually about 100,000 to 300,000 scholar units. Can't imagine how hot that is, I just know how hot it is when it actually hits my mouth. And I'm sure that everybody out there who's actually watching this video have tried these orange habaneros and have always been taken aback about how actually hot they are. So we'll see what happens. But first, I'm going to cut, in, cut it inside and see if there's anything lurking in before I eat it. Uh, I imagine it's got that um, normal to typical orange habanero smell. Ooh. I'll try and show you the inside if I can. Can you see? Can you focus on them? As you can see, there's not much inside. A few seeds, and that's about your lot. Oops, on my nose. That's going to hurt me later. Never mind. It's not much of a smell, so look, there's not much of that typical habanero smell, so I don't think this is going to be as hot. Famous last words. So let's give it a go. First of the season of the orange habaneros. I have quite a few of these growing, so hopefully they'll be nice and hot. Lovely, lovely sweet taste. Mm. No idea of the time. I'm just going to sit here and take it. Mmm. Very nice. Just doesn't remember the nuts yet. So I'll just let that cook and see what happens. Mmm. That's, that's quite warm, that one. Yes, that is, uh, that's warm. Typical things, the back of the mouth, that's, that's really lit up quite well. <clears throat> and the side of the tongue, that's starting to come into play now. <clears throat> but it wasn't like that uh, chocolate hab. The chocolate hab was almost instant power heat. Um, heat. This is uh, just starting to cook and starting to build from the back of the mouth. But it's it's hot, but it's not too hot at the moment. It's as I remember them, so I'm not expecting anything other than a good kick in the teeth, really. Um, but um, talking is quite difficult, I must admit. I was surprised when I watch other people say that that they can't talk. I can understand now why. Because it, 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 it light, lights up the vocal cords and boom, instant pain. So, hang on a minute. Ooh, that's quite warm. That's surprisingly quite nice as well. Uh, yeah, there's not much more pain now. It's starting to, it's starting to become a more global burn. 
Well, I'm not experiencing this time round, which I experienced with the hot, the chocolate habanero, was the uh, my tongue, the chocolate habanero, was a little bit numb, but was still with pain. And this, I'm just getting pain. I'm not getting numb. So there you go. Uh, what else I'm experiencing? The taste is gone. All I'm left with is uh, heat all over my mouth. Not much in the throat. I can feel it a little bit in the stomach, but nothing, Ugh. nothing to worry about. And um, I'm starting to sweat a bit, but there again, it's quite hot here. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, my nose is starting to run, and my eyes are starting to, to go a bit. But there you go, that's about it. So, the orange habanero should be nice with sauces. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again later. Bye. Okay, it's been about a minute or so since I've eaten that chili, and I thought I'd give my mouth a bit of a calm down, because uh, I found it very hard to talk before. And um, yeah, that was a very nice chili. Um, still plenty of heat in the old mouth, not much in the throat. Started to feel it a bit in the tummy, but not much more than, say, a normal curry. So yeah, that's a really nice chili. Um, I want to see how that one tastes, but because of the heat of this first one that I've eaten, I don't think I'll get the ability to to actually see how it actually tastes, you know, how sweet it was, how hard it was. So I'll do this one, which is this year's, from this year's plant, um, probably tomorrow. So, see you again, and thanks for watching.